New patch, new crunt. We're gonna experiment today and try to play without a deck tracker. I feel like it sort of constrains my vision in a weird way. It's like having these things on the periphery of the screen screws me up. I feel like I see fewer options with those things up, which is, you know, probably not objectively true, but it feels like that. And I think it also impedes the process of getting a feel for a deck when you have, like, the mulligan win rates and everything served to you. It's like, you have to decide what's good for it in, in what situation. So we're playing Zarimi Priest. <clears throat> Habu Gabu's list with Gyre Worms, um, which felt pretty good. I did a little playing this afternoon. Not much, just like one or two games. Hmm. Okay. Not an amazing turn from my friend. I think I will play Pip just for one card. Um, seems better than playing Razor Scale right now. What one cost cards does a Death Knight play? That's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate. That feels good. And also strange. What am I gonna want to power cord synchronize in this matchup? I'm four away. I've got functionally four in hand. Be nice if those buffs could land on Zarimi. She barking at her um, bed. I guess the other power cord synchronized um, target in my deck would be, in, in my hand, excuse me, would be Zilliax. If I could get that down to zero. I can't play all of these things at once. I think I'll hold the Thirsty Drifter, assuming he kills the Razor Scale, or she kills the Razor Scale, for my Zerimi turn. Zerimi is active. That seems like a good draw. Ooh, and no.
Now I could pop off with Zerimi right now. How does he deal with that? Threads of Despair. He's already used one Threads of Despair. He's got six cards. I think we go for it. damage. It's like pseudo charge in this instance. Mm -hmm. Fresca? No, Threads of Despair. Wow. Okay. So we did have the other one. That's unfortunate. Uh huh. I want to wait. Can I play one, two, three, four, five? I can. Oh, my God. He's got to heal. But that's not the Primus. Okay, he's going to go up to six if he goes face. Can't forget to forge. Strong win. Gyroworm feels really good. The duel versus Justice Jaina. There's a bounty on your head. I foresaw this encounter. Coin out a flame elemental or whatever it's called. What's that card called? Deal two. Time's almost up. Get an elemental. <clears throat> All right, so I have a choice here. I think I do this. I kind of would rather the buff hit something else. But that's fine. If 
cryo. Interesting. Mm, I don't have a dragon in hand. Draw so we can have a dragon in hand. Can you tie her up or something? I got her all riled up. You got her all riled up. Okay. You winning? I don't know yet. Nope. Two left on Zarimi. Maybe I save one of the Celestial Projectionists for Zilliax. But does that mean I should go Y? Well, it's not mana efficient. Interesting. Frostbolt doesn't really bother me. I think I'm gonna do this and do this. Yeah. Is this the next deck to get nerfed? I don't know. When Zerimi comes, it's basically over. Garrosh. Um. I don't think I keep Gyroworm. I don't think I keep Drifter. can coin out Chirurgeon Salesman or I can coin out Pip uh, I think I'm gonna coin out Pip is feeling tasty so far. Uh -huh. Starting the operation. Starting the operation.
Ziliax would be nice. I can Glad I didn't see a safety goggles there. Uh, I need a way to play two dragons. Brawl. What's he gonna do here with his two leftover mana? Blade Storm? Hmm, interesting. Good win. 